Dear civil engineers, welcome back to School of Civil Engineering. This is Ayatollah with another new video, our real project building design tutorial series. So in your previous lecture, I have just provided you a introduction video. And in this lecture, I'll show you and I'll provide you an important thing. So as an engineer, then you have no enough time to define that materials or everything every time okay so all I what I do actually I use a default format for etabs and I will share with you that that link are given in description okay so if you need that you can download that and if you follow my that real project design process then if you download that uh, I mean if you download that default format then it will be very helpful for you so now suppose I'll just click here open new no I don't want to change so here this is my default format project one I'm opening and here is my default format I have opened and if I go here define and if I go materials properties just see already have different everything so this is for my reinforcement okay this is for reinforcement and here for concrete just see already have everything different and if you need to modify that you know that sim by simply clicking here you have to modify and if you need to know i mean if you want to learn from basic then they have a, a link given in description about beginner level to advanced level tutorial series okay so as i am doing here a real project design that's why i will not take huge time to do that okay and if you need to learn that that its link is given in description i'll request to please use that tutorial series then you will learn everything about etabs like i have many video about etabs okay so now again if i go here section properties then frame section already see i have defined many section here i have defined here many section previously okay so and also if you need to modify that simply click here and modify from here and if you need to modify that from here also you are able to modify from here clear and uh, section properties or materials property are uh, property modifier i will not use here i will use that later then i'll click ok so if you want to learn a real project design then please stay with me and after that you'll be able to design a structure by using that software that are real so i'll click ok again i'll go define then section properties and then slab section just see here a staircase slab six inch i have different and uh, floor slab five inch i have defined already i'll just click ok and i can go define so from here uh, i have different everything now i'll defend wall here so here wall one that is already pre defined i'll click here and from here i'll take a 10 inch wall okay and materials 2800 psi it's okay the national size data if you need to do from here then you can uh, notational data you can use i will not use and the modeling type that is shell thin and modifier if you need to use modifier then you can use that at this time i will not use any modifier cancel and here i'll give thickness 10 okay and if you need property nodes then you can give here and property modifier i will not use anything actually and if you need to change that color you can change its color so if i just use that color then okay then okay so i have defined a wall for 10 inch this is for our uh share all for lift coral then i'll click okay okay so when everything is okay again i'll go here then I'll go for our here load pattern. I'll click here and see here already I have defined dead dot live dot row or uh, float live dot row floor finish partition all earthquake x earthquake y wx and w i I'll use uh, ASC705 ASC705 ASC705705 uh, for both earthquake and wind load and i'll uh, modify that load after completing our model i'll click ok and again i'll go here load conversion just see here i have defined 
all of our load combination okay as per aci 318 Rest by uh, as per three one eight zero eight both okay. Here, uh, this is for all dead load and all live load, and this is for our clip settlement and long term effect check. This is for and this is for envelope okay, and also this is for vertical deflection. And this, uh, here, the combination for this is combination for foundation already have defined here. And when I need, I will use that combination to model our structure. So here I'll click OK. Just see everything I have defined. And if I go here, uh, load case, just see here, I have defined all of our load case previously. Here I have defined everything. So uh, I think if you take that format, default format, then uh, it will be clear to you that how we can use that format. sorry and uh, just see everything I have done everything I have done already okay so I'll request you I'll request you if you new here and also I have different power level here uh, change name power level okay already have different power level so if you need uh, I mean if you need that format then I'll request to that link are given in description first of all download that default format and from our next lecture i'll try to create our model okay so uh, i'll use that model this is a real project design i'll use that model and i'll design that model with you so thank you thank you very much and if you're new to our channel then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon so that you get every update ever first and also uh, if you want to support us then join as a member in our channel to support us so thank you thank you very much your support will inspire us for the next work. So thank you. Thank you very much. Stay connected till next video.